Okay, okay. Anyways, nah, though. Um, this is where the cheating allegations came. She would always blame me. And you know me, I'm grown still, so it's like, bro, if you blaming me and I'm chilling, I know it's you. I don't go through phones. I wasn't into none of that. Because me mentally, I'm like, boy, I just, we just got a crib. I don't furnish the whole crib and just told you, come on, we good. Why would I go cheap? And it wasn't no cheap crib. This crib just got built. This crib, nobody ever lived in it. We were the, I was, we was the first home owners in that crib. We. You feel me? I'm talking about, I was at work and I'm like, they just put the crib up on, on, the, on the market. You feel me? It's up. If you want it, go look at it. Call me back. I'm on break right now. Call me back and let me know. Yeah, you like it. And it's a wrap. I'm getting it. I didn't even see the crib, G. So she called me back. I like it. Cool. I got off work. Got what I needed. Gave it to the people. We had the keys. Those are the pictures y'all see. Up on the TikTok. Got the crib. Whatever. That was me. But so in my head, I'm like, why would I go through all of this, put you in a brand new house to go cheat? I'm not like some of these people. Some people do do that, but that wasn't me. But I, I wasn't doing that. But I was ready to sit my down with one person and just build off of that. You feel me? And the foundation I came with, y'all be like, what you could bring to the table? This. I got the crib. Now add on. 